we're going to go now to CBS News investigative reporter Graham Cates, who has been essentially camped out uh, uh, outside of the courthouse for uh, several days. Now, Graham, it's good to see you. First of all and for foremost, what is your reaction to all of this? I mean, you were inside the courtroom where there was no cameras allowed. What do you make of these charges? You know, I think uh, when when they were actually read out, we had heard that there were going to be something along these lines, but uh, hearing the court clerk say, uh, Donald Trump, you are charged with 34 counts of falsifi felony falsification of business records. Uh, you know, I, I think the whole room kind of came to attention. Everyone understood what this, mean, what this means historically. This was a former president sitting in front of us in a seat that uh, over the years thousands of criminal defendants have sat in, uh, looking up at a judge uh, who has been there long enough that probably thousands of criminal defendants have looked up at that judge. But this was different. This was the former president who was being arraigned, who had to, to say the words not guilty, um, who had to speak to the judge and say that he understood his rights, that um, he knows that he can switch attorneys if he wants to, uh, and that he, he knows that he's expected to appear at other hearings unless uh, there are mitigating circumstances or if his behavior isn't right. These are all things that other defendants time and time and time again here, but no other former president has had to sit through. And it was really a fascinating sight to see. And it was fascinating to see it in this building behind me that has been here for 80 years. You know, the, the ceilings have uh, paint kind of falling off and, and it looks really old. It's not the kind of room you ever picture Donald Trump being in. And, and there he was, uh, surrounded by court officers and Secret Service agents. I counted, I think, 26 combined in this small room with some 60 other reporters and some lawyers. Uh, it, was, it was, for sure, uh, an unusual uh, sight to see. Yeah, no matter the lead up to all of this, just seeing that image from that courtroom uh, was indeed history making.